Data mining. Data mining is the process of analyzing large data sets in hopes of revealing patterns and correlations among the data. In data mining, the emphasis is on the discovery of new knowledge. Data miners want to find new patterns that were previously unobserved. However, data mining can result in the observation of no useful patterns. There are many tools and programs available to help data scientists find patterns, trends, and new knowledge from big data. Programs are used in an iterative and interactive way to filter and clean digital data and to process information to allow users to gain insight and knowledge about data. Combining data sources, clustering data, and classifying data are parts of the process of using programs to gain insight and knowledge from data. Data insights can be obtained from translating and transforming digitally represented information. Patterns can emerge when data is transformed using programs. Data mining involves six common classes of tasks. Anomaly detection, association rule learning, clustering, classification, regression, and summarization. Anomaly detection is the identification of unusual data records that require further investigation. Anomaly detection is also referred to as outlier, change, or deviation detection. One common example of anomaly detection is when your credit card company suspects fraudulent activity. Although there are many strategies for credit card fraud detection, one of the simplest is the use of outlier detection. For example, if you live in Texas and all of a sudden there is a charge for a gas station in California, your credit card company may send you a notification because they detect this is an outlier in your purchasing habits. Association rule learning, also called dependency modeling, searches for relationships between variables. French toast is one of America's favorite breakfast foods. If you are making French toast, you're going to need milk, bread, and eggs. By using association rules, we can group items together logically and attempt to make predictions. If most people who buy milk, bread, and eggs also buy syrup, then association rule mining might turn up the following rule. Buying milk, bread, and eggs may lead to buying syrup. An association rule is a link between one set of items and another. Another data mining strategy is clustering. Clustering is discovering groups and structures in the data that are somehow similar without using known structures in the data. Clustering attempts to group related data into subsets called clusters. Data scientists can then analyze not only the distribution of the data into the clusters, but also the characteristics of each cluster. Classification is generalizing known structure to apply to new data. For example, an email program might attempt to classify an email as legitimate or as spam. Regression analysis studies the possible relationship between one factor and one or more variable. An example might be a landscape nursery projecting sales of their bedding plants increasing during the spring and summer months when the weather is warmer. Summarization is taking all the insights gained from the data analysis and providing a more compact representation of the dataset, including visualization and report generation. So, is there just one data analysis strategy that is the best? Of course not. Just like in other areas of computer science, there isn't just one way that is the best. Data miners use multiple strategies to uncover patterns and discover new knowledge. These strategies all have different purposes, are sometimes more effective on certain datasets and less on others, and often work best in conjunction with one another. To recap data mining, data mining is the process of analyzing large datasets in hopes of revealing patterns and correlations among the data. Data mining involves six common classes of tasks, anomaly detection, association rule learning, clustering, 
classification, regression, and summarization. Data miners use multiple strategies to uncover patterns and discover new knowledge.